It is weather for ducksless, isn't it? And coots. Ducks and drakes. Um, I'm really enjoying doing my, well, finishing off really my course on Charles Dickens. And he um, only lived into his late 50s. Towards the end of his life, he was sort of quite despondent about the way society is go it was going uh, not just his personal life it, it was um, it, you know he had he wasn't perfect he was no saint but it he was a great humanitarian so I think the positives outweigh the negatives in my humble opinion but he um, he just thought uh, the lack of humanity present in his age, in his day and age um, got to him basically and that's shown in some of his more depressing novels because he, he writes with, with a kind of semi autobiographical context even though it's fictionalized and it was all doom and gloom and that's really how he felt about the state of humanity back then and the positive is that I, I met with a, a very compassionate group today um, and they were talking about the um, impact of poverty nationwide and the sort of cold, callous sort of subtext and element in society, especially with those who have um, not just p politically but anybody in a position of authority and professional status the way they talk to people uh, it's not all people but some people they just don't care and uh, I'm I've um, I'm trying desperately to sort of get my Facebook back from this hacker because I, I share lots of posts and a lot of them about well-being and, and nature posts and um, all I'm asking them to do basically is let me reset my password by sending it to my email address which is something I've always had on my Facebook it had it's never been anything else but this hacker has somehow got into it and ruined things for me and uh, it's not like they're adding anything to the creativity they're not sort of doing much with my personal with my personal pages uh, my poetry I can't sort of add to my poems it's my anthology I've got nine pages some of them very important to me I've got a, a hell of a lot of writing if you add it up all of that I'm he's not doing anything or she even because at first i thought it it was some elderly lady with a, a like long blonde wig or or maybe they just dyed their hair and they're calling themselves penny davis spelt wrong but that could be a, a, a red herring but i'm not sure she did look a bit odd uh, i'm c kind to people but it was just how she looked and i saw my name being spelt wrong on this profile uh, and there are a couple of profiles with my name spelt wrong on them and uh, you know I'm, I'm, I'm <laughs> it's all my writing basically it's, it's just in the that that fun facts about dogs was uh, it, it's my page um, it's not something that I wrote a lot on it's something that I shared a lot of fun stuff on uh, but it, it was me that created it I've got nine pages of writing I can't access um, you know I, I it's a business page so by legal rights I have that right for them to just reset my password they know it's hacked I, I've had that same email address since 2010 um, and also I'm, I'm very pleased with um, uh, the feedback from the Chesh Cheshire Constabulary. They, uh, 
um, John Dwan sent me a, note, a supportive email saying it, it's just not on at all uh, in so many words and it, it's not um, it's like uh, writing a book and then someone it, that's the amount of writing there is on those nine pages and then someone just taking it over not adding anything to it not benefiting anybody um, just purely selfish behavior it's mine and all that effort I put into those pages and um, to be honest um, you know that that's what keeps me going keeps me happy because um, you know uh, I've had past traumas and things and uh, at first I thought oh um, during my childhood it, it, you don't get uh, it's difficult if you're like uh, a few years ahead of your time with the um, education lay you get isolated a bit and then but I thought everything was on the up because everybody catches up eventually and there's a nice camaraderie with people I've known a long time and it improves things improve uh, and I didn't think I thought my life was heading in the right direction. Uh, I've had to deal with so many negative people just because I, um, people that I close that were close to me have had issues, and it, it uh, you know I felt I'd matured well, actualized well, and you know you don't need need this. Um, it's um, sometimes people resent charismatic people that are well educated, don't they? Decent people don't. Uh, I don't think decent people are sexist at all. You know, guys. Uh, it's just uh, whether or not they they're of good character, basically, and or decency, and it doesn't matter what you are, who you are, etc. And I thought, oh, I'm, I'm a cute person, I'll do well. Y you know, it wasn't, uh, I think everyone should get the chance to do well, but I thought, oh, uh, you know, it, it's got to be positive. You, you can see, uh, I don't think it means anything, but you can see the kindness in my eyes. But uh, I don't think that is anything to do with it, but I, you can see that, that cuteness. And I thought, I'm lucky. And because I'm lucky, I'll be happy and I'll, it, everything will be happy, uh, even if times were difficult when I was younger. And, you know, it, it's not really that, is it? Um, I think uh, I'm trying to be brave and courageous and keep going, but it's... Um, it's difficult when my creative work gets hacked into and, and they're not doing anything with it they're just like taking it they've just taken it over and just just for I think it, it could be almost like bullying and people are indifferent and uh, it's it's not just hacking for money I don't think but I've informed the police anyway and they're aware of it it I don't know whether they're hack they've hacked into my account, spelt it wrongly just to scam people. I think it's just um, bloody mindedness, to be honest. Why, why do that when it's somebody's created, pay, you know, they, they've taken time to set up about nine pages, all with different messages in, things that I've written. Why do something like that? And it's just cut me off from my friends that I've known a long time. I know I had, I, I, I've learnt the lesson that I, I, I'll update my privacy setting when I get a chance, but it should have been resolved by now because it's causing me distress. Um, it's, um, I've got other ways of keeping myself happy. I keep creative, but I, you know, it's, it's worrying. I mean, what the hell's going on? 
Um, it feels because I'm I, I'm quite good at writing stuff. Uh, it feels like resentment, but it could be the fact that I'm just talking to an AI, which is a robot, and um, that's why the response is really stupid. Um, I, I think new technology and meta are quite good but I mean there's the pitfalls if they're not able to emote or equate the relevance of things even though they're good at holding information there's a pitfall which I tended to overlook I mean I, I, I love um, three-dimensional dogs and avatars and stuff like that which are fun but this is really um, not good actually the fact that I can't access my work and I'm talking to Meta to try and resolve the issue so there you go